Hi, my name is Dr. Claire Albright, and today I'm going to go over the history and the uses of hemoencephalography, a type of neurofeedback for ADD, the uses for anxiety, depression, and migraine headaches. And it could help a little bit with schizophrenia, and I'm sure there's many other uses. And it's a very exciting type of therapy that was invented 17 years ago by Herschel Tuman. Stumbled upon it in his inventions, the way so many things are invented. It was serendipitous, I'll call it. I'll make up a word for that. And then Jeffrey Carmen in New York, he is a psychologist who built on the work of Herschel Tuman over the past 15 years and has really kept improving it. So hemoencephalography looks like this. Hemo stands for blood, the blood flow in the front of the brain. And encephalography is a word that stands for graphing something. So it means graphing the blood flow in the front of the brain. And in the prefrontal cortex, if you look at the front of someone's head, um, up here, you have depression and anxiety on the left side that you can help with and focusing and concentration on the right side, as well as organization, good judgment, and motivation. So there's so many things that the prefrontal cortex helps to switch on and off when you really increase the activity in the prefrontal cortex. The research is showing that people who've had trauma, a lot of the brain activity flows to the back of the brain leaving this prefrontal cortex needing more metabolism. And hemoencephalography, which is also shortened for HEG, will help balance that out and improve the prefrontal cortex functioning. So the history is 17 years of research, and the uses are great reduction in your migraine headaches, great reduction in your ADD and ADHD, great reduction in your anxiety, great reduction in your anger management problems, reduction in depression, a little improvement for schizophrenia, improved motivation, improved good judgment, organization. So what's not to love? Thank you.